Yeah, uh, we'll go to the interview section of this cast right now as Hildreth joins us. And uh, if you have just joined us here in Team Force TV, you've missed the main action, but I am admirable. Here with me is Ryushi. We've got John on the camera, and now we're joined by Lazy Pandas, Demo Man, and leader Hildreth. How did you feel about that uh, decisive loss right there, Hildreth? Was it what you expected? Um, not really, no. I thought we could play Bello and Granary. Grally Wash, you know, I'm just glad we didn't get five dealt in the end. In fact, where were the Russians? Um, we, we didn't organise this, don't worry. I'll try and get Digger in now. That's good. But you keep talking, you know. Tell <laughs> you're, saying, your you're, saying, well, you're, you're saying you thought you could have gone better on Granary. Um, from our perspective, you looked a lot better on Gully Wash than you did on Granary as a team. Well, Was the scoreline says you it just, all... Uh, no, no, I, I, I think overall, um, like Tracker was seemed to be according to the logs and from what we saw, like not very good on Granary, but on Gully Wash was actually a lot more useful. I mean, on Granary we had a big problem winning middles and stuff, and then when we um, just tried to rush things too much, apparently our bad middles, according to Zub, were because of bad positioning and inexperience. I didn't feel like I did too much wrong on middle, maybe could have done more damage, but in general we just felt like a bit of a mess in mids, like there was one middle where I rolled out left and our um, medic went right and I had no idea, and that sort of stuff happens in matches, it's not going to go well for you. Yeah, but I think a, a, a lot of things like that can be attributed to the fact that, you know, Mookie, Tracker, Lazy Bear and Steve are all really, really exper uh, inexperienced, should I say. Um, I mean, how long have you guys been as a team? Not Not that long, surely. Well, we've been playing since about week two or three of last season, but we barely played like maybe once a week and haven't played very often because of the Highlander season. So we have been together for a while. We've played a lot with Sheepy, but he wants to, he's gone off our team now. But it's to be expected, I guess. I mean, for example, Steve played his first 6v6 medic official today. I'm proud of him. He did well. Yeah, he's already he, as good some, as Admiral. Well, yeah, I mean, the three drops is really puts him on the level of I'd, I'd admire. Yeah, three drop minimum for me. That's that's my policy in officials. Hello, everyone. Hey, Dicker. Oh. We're joined by uh, the 425 Medic Dicker as well here. And uh, we'd like to congratulate you on your six points here. A good start to the season. <laughs> uh, tell I dropped the first game, dude. <laughs> <laughs> on the first minute, first two, the drop prem. Nice. Tell me, what's your target for the season, Dicker? Are you, are you aiming to get into the playoffs? Or are you just hoping not to get relegated? Do you want to win the whole thing outright? Are you going for gold this season? I don't think about gold, but uh, we want to try about uh, to take the fourth place. No, play, make playoffs, something like that. What about the, the rivalry between the two Russian teams? You know, you've got 425, you've got ggwellplayed.pro. Uh, you want to beat those guys? Is that your main, your main goal? Not exactly. It's just a regular game. How are things between the two teams? Is it is it good spirited? Is it good natured? Or is there a lot of rivalry there? Uh, can you repeat, please? Do you uh, do you hate the other Russian team? Do you have a, a good ah, relationship? Yes, 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 of course. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're trying to start some Especially drama MSH. here. Yeah. Especially MSH. Everybody hates MSH. That's no yeah. problem. Yeah, even uh, his own team hate MSH. Hildreth, I'd like to ask as well, like, what's the the Lazy Pandas approach to the season? What are you guys hoping to achieve? Are you just here to learn or are you looking to make playoffs as well? Have you got a goal in mind when you start it with this team? Uh, we're doing a sort of Wigan Athletic, try not to get relegated kind of thing. <laughs> the, I mean, the main goal is just to play and um, compete as the main goal. Like, we were really disappointed. We got 5 0 but we were much happier in Gully, even though we lost. I mean, 425 were just a better team than us. They've been together for three seasons. They've got really good players. Like uh, the Demo Man Def, we were all complaining about him. Just controlling most of the fights. And um, Kenzie as well. He's an amazing player, like that 4K on the Gully Wash. So we didn't really expect to win. I mean, maybe we'll be able to beat Saints. And um, we've had good PCWs against GGWP. So we could still get a season. 
Yeah, I mean, uh, it's interesting because a lot of a lot was said in the preseason that Lazy Pandas were a team who didn't have to play a single game to get into Prem, but there here you are against four twenty five, probably the team that played the most games to get into Prem. They finished second and then had to play Lego and beat them, got in the good old fashioned way. Do you think you deserve to be here, Hildreth, or are you just making up the numbers in the Prem? Well, to be honest, I'm surprised there weren't any playoffs. Oh, we, we applied for Prem because we obviously there was a lot of folded teams and we thought that we'd be able to get into like a preseason playoff. But then we were just yeah. put straight in and it says a lot really about the level. It's gonna be a good season anyway, but we'll probably be seventh if at our best. Maybe sixth if we get a few cheeky maps off of some of the teams that people didn't expect us to beat. How's the uh, atmosphere? I know it's tough to take a 5-0 loss like that, but uh, how did you guys handle it on Mumble? Was the, the spirit still there? Team spirit? Well, <laughs> Granary, it wasn't so good. I mean, it's the fact that we have some guy from Belarus on our team is the main issue. I don't know how you put up with them, Dicker. It's that tracker guy, man. What can I say? What's the problem? He doesn't say anything? or He doesn't hit every headshot. Like Kenzie does. Yeah, it was surprising when we saw the sniper, but it it was not tracker. It was lazy beer. Hey, uh, awesome. Lazy beer. Yeah. And then it was very fun when you push out from your last, and we came on your last, and there is no one. What what's the problem? <laughs> when there is no one. It's a free free last. Um. I guess just an experience about yeah, it's... like covering entrances and stuff like that. I don't yeah, know. Has it's not my fault, Dicker. Yeah. Have you yeah, seen yeah, the logs? Who top damaged? You. This is <laughs> cheap. As they ever extend and die. Yeah, top damaged on Gullywash. Yeah, you got. Death had 32 frags and you had 21. Yeah, What's see. the point of doing all this damage if you're not actually killing people? Or capping points, man. Are you the new true. war? Are you just padding your stats? Yeah, that's the goal. This season, pad the stats. Nobody cares about winning the title anymore. It's all about being number one in John's articles. Gentleman John, that is. Not that's our what I'm going amazing for. cameraman, Black Eyed John. Uh, let me think. You got any more cre- questions, Ryushi? I have one more for Eldrith. Um, why, why not as much crit sticker? Come on, you... Russian. Surely the crits should be every single middle. Wait, because we have crits on Granary. Yeah, no. once or twice, but I was I, I wanted more, man. Crits is the best. We are besides them, besides you, you, team. you were killing them before you even had crits. Sometimes they are not aggressive style of players, you know. But our just situational. Uh, ah, fair enough. Fair enough. We You're not white glow. GVP. Yeah, yeah. We are. I'm not white glow. <laughs> this is not GDK, you know. He's Ukrainian. Yeah, Hildreth, I just want to ask you about your Premiership preview article. I know it's sitting in the back end on Team Fortress TV. When are we likely to see that bad boy released? Well, I was thinking of doing it after the game, but like a lot of stuff might need to be rewritten because it was written on the weekend, and then obviously now it's the week day, and I don't have time to do it in the week. But um, I was a bit. I was going to finish it, but then I decided to start reading your predictions, <laughs> and um, a bit of an inside joke here, it kind of put me off admirable. Oh, wow. The preview uh, wasn't very pleasant. I started um, working on a week one preview as well, but uh, didn't manage to make it out in time before the first game. Apologies, Team Forest You wrote one sentence. Oh, not that one. There, there's more to it now, if you look at it. Is that the, when I read it? It said <laughs> I just like big dicks or something. <clears throat> yeah, whenever I was creating my article, I just said Hildreth sucks big dicks, you know, because I knew he'd read it. No, I, I clearly was the guy who broke your spirit before. I'll finish game. it. I'll just finish it tonight. I mean, it'll be a bit out of date, but I'll just finish it tonight and get on with it. Let's uh, stop talking shop here. Anyway, uh, I think we'll call the interviews to an end, and I will thank. John for doing the camera tonight. This has been Team Forest TV with Admirable and Ryushi on the mics. We've been here for the interviews with Hildreth and Dicker. But this is the end of the show here for this ETF2L Season 18 part by TTE Sports Premiership. Week 1 fixture between 425 and Lazy Pandas. You saw 425 take all six points 
Uh, Lazy Panda's proven that Highlander players are no good. Boo. Take that, Twitch chat. Any final thoughts, Hildreth? Um, just well played to 425. They're a very good team. Dicker, you got any shout outs? Hildreth is good too. And oh, thank you. Rishi, give me a final thought before we sign off. Um, my final thought is that Admirable is not allowed to insult Highlander players anymore as he is a Prem Highlander player himself. I'm a Prem default hunter. Bottom of the table though. But uh, yeah, thanks and good night.